Hello. Um, so, welcome back. As you can see, I'm here again. I've started again. The reason for that is I, I, I'm not really sure about um, uh, like biomes plenty and stuff. Um, I'm also getting getting a lot of errors with rock pounding. Um, but yeah, we'll see what happens anyway. Um, it may be to do with the stellar API thing. I don't know. And the main problem, the main problem I would say is probably this one with the quest book. This, the quest book mod has had such a huge problem. Um, and we're going to see it with this one. Because this, I believe, doesn't work. What I've had to do is I've started again. I'm going to probably have to start like multiple times over the next few episodes of this series. Um, but yeah, it was better I start because to be honest, at first I was a bit annoyed that I lost my save from like you know from the last two episodes ago. But interestingly, if you remember on the last bit, I was actually on uh, 400 pages, and now it's back to a thousand. Huh. So I don't know what's going with that. So yeah, we're going to have to see now what happens with... Um, we'll take... Just take the axe again. Why not? The invalid item is there. But now, materials are new. Volume 1. What I'm going to do this time... As you see, the problem is I didn't craft it. And it got, it got given at the beginning of the game. So that may be a little bit of a problem. So just a paper and a black pattern, that should be fine. So let's uh, let's actually uh, craft the... Uh, yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to craft the book here. We'll get rid of everything we don't need. Yeah, the raw beef came as well here. So basically, yeah, that was interesting to be honest. That was very interesting. Uh, the way that things have changed. But yeah, I just thought let's have a completely new instance. It's going to be difficult, like I say, over the next few weeks uh, and months, but we will see what happens. Um, we are we've got extreme hills there, though. So let's get. Let's see what we can find, anyway. This is always useful. This is how I start very right at the beginning of the whole series actually. I'm not gonna go for the dark oak. I mean I could, but I'm not going to. I wanna find village, I wanna find oil, I wanna find uh Yeah, I mean, where else the problem village and oil do I want? Village, oil, slime island, I think, would be good. But first task will be just to make the book, see if I can uh, get to that quest without it crashing. Because I can't unlock the chapters, that's going to be a bit problematic, isn't it? Can I break this with my hand? I think I can. So yeah, maybe there's some reeds here, no? Yeah, I'm gonna need some reeds, pretty sharpish. Not so worried about the extreme hills. Um, although, it's not a bad idea. Yeah, the extreme hills were somewhere around here, weren't they? So just in case this one happens to... Uh, just because I, I don't want to have to... We'll see anyway, we'll see what happens. Yeah. Alright, so we don't really want to be here. Yeah, 
Yeah, Roof Forest is not a good spawn, really. Uh, my feeling is just, uh, yep. Like I said, the biomes are plenty of stuff. It does, it does affect things negatively, and it's not really worth it. Did I put any settings which I don't want? Uh, probably lower that down a bit. So I'm hoping for a village. But really, uh, the priority is just the sugar cane, I would say. Or bamboo, of course. And we'll take these deviating lilies. Yeah, the roof forest very bad uh, performance. <laughs> Don't want to be near them. Let's try and get away from that. Yeah, really, what I'd like is somehow if I could find a village, or a wi uh, not a wi uh, evil craft area, something like that. Here's my swamp. So that's already good. And there's the reeds. Okay, this is looking good now. This is looking pretty good actually. I do like the swamp. Got access to a lot of peat. Uh, yeah. All right, let's not let's not um, piss around then. Let's just uh, see if we can get the spawn here then. Uh, yeah. So we should have lots of uh, those spots. Yeah, you see, it's just a lot easier just to play with a normal um, world. You get uh, that is not enough though. Let's head into this a bit more. I mean, I would like a village, to be honest. But also, I'd like the game not to crash when I craft the book. Oh, there's oil here, which is good. So we've got the oil. Okay. And that's a real big one, that. That's a really strong one. It's stronger than the one I found in the last episode. Let me just uh, cruise around on a boat. I missed using the boats. That's probably, for me, the, the boat thing is probably the worst change. Because I really, really like the old boats. They were like super good. But yeah, this is a very, very good oil source here. You see, what I may do the thing is right I know for a fact that the um, it's very possible that 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 uh, HQM is just not going to work like for months or ever because it's not I'm pretty sure it's not getting updated what that means is that yeah what that means is that I may just because the mo the reason I use the mod pack really is just because of the uh, the large number of mods and you know actively maintained and all that right but um, I would like to I would like to of course use this quest book because that's the whole point of it in a sense but in another sense it's not really the point of it 
Um, and because I've already followed the quest book, it's not necessarily... Uh, I'm not going to get a huge amount of benefit from... Uh, but yeah, so... What I'd like to do is see if we can find either a slime island or a village in the nearby vicinity. That would be something which... or something else, basically. So interestingly, that... The funny thing is the oil is so big that you can actually... I don't even need to landmark it. Yeah, that's probably... I think that's... I think this is the largest size you can get, actually, now I think about it. But this is a huge area of something. Damn it. Yeah, let's see if we can find the uh, reeds there. No. See, I may want to go back to that point that I was already at, which is right next to the oil, because that was probably the closest land spot near the oil. I can't remember, but this is good, I think, this stuff. Probably loading up a bit too much. Now they're all they're all twos, aren't they, on their own? That sucks. Should I just try it with it? No, I don't want to. I really don't want to. I think it's going to be a mistake to do that. How's their skeleton on the mini map? That is... I don't think I've ever seen that before. That shouldn't be the case. Hmm, maybe they've changed. Unless it's changed. We'll see. We'll see, anyway. I am surprised to see a skeleton there, though. Oh, no. There must be a spawner. That's why. Interesting. I'm going to actually look through, yeah. I'll be able to go right next to the spawner then in that case. So the oil is there. Yeah, this, this spot here is actually the nearest. Is it definitely the nearest? Yeah, it is. There's no way. Yeah. But I do want to find some different stuff there. I just, I would like to have a village and I would like to have a uh, evil craft section as well. So the roof forest is all in the east. Yeah, I'm going about the right way. Here. Just want to find. Oh, might be something here. Looks like more roofed forest. Yeah, I'm not convinced.
I need a spade already, don't I? Yeah, you can't get it without it. All right, let's get some. Uh, let's just get a juicer just so I can eat some food. Uh, Oops. Where's that light source coming from? Oh, that's odd. for the juicer. you think I'd know this by now. Just a stone and a pressure plate. Three pieces of stone. It's not an amazing spawn, but the oil is good. Oh yeah, I mean, I could find a rock handling heart. That'd be very, very unlikely there. I picked up the two, I picked up two reeds. I guess it's not necessarily that important to find anything else. I'm just worried about this. Here's the thing though, why is it like that already? It 
I mean, when you look at the fucking description, it doesn't really, it doesn't give you, fill me with confidence. So I want to click on it because I feel like it's going to crash it. You know what? I'm going to find out once and for all if it's going to crash it. Yeah, I am. I just want to know. What biome do you find this in? Oh, just chestnut bar. Cash chestnut, cashew, almond, pistachio. Okay, so a lot of the trees will actually provide me. Basically, they used to be only peanut butter, so it's changed. That's changed a lot. Right, so now I want to just make the materials in you. So just one paper, one blank pattern. Okay, let's make blank patterns. Okay, so we're going to chuck away this one because there's obviously something wrong with it. Is he, are you going to crash? If it is, it's the end of the episode. So thanks for watching. Oh.